my absolutely cool crew. Yeah. Anyways, um, so this is a video that came about just very spontaneously, um, because I actually am gonna draw something today, um, and I'm gonna show you how I draw personally. I actually, unbelievably, don't really look at tutorials much at all, really. Um, <laughs> and I'm by no means an expert. Um, so yeah, there's probably going to be a lot of errors in this tutorial. Well, it's not really a tutorial, it's just really just showcasing how I draw. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much about it. Uh, yes, why do I have a fucking robe on? Well, obviously, because I don't have anything else to wear. Or, well, I do, but <laughs> I don't have anything fitting to wear because fuck my life, I guess. Um, and just because the robes look fucking awesome. Uh, <laughs> yeah, so anyway, let's jump right in, bruh. So, of course, the first thing you're gonna want to have is a sketchbook. A fucking sketch. Well, you don't need a sketchbook, you can just pull out some fucking paper. Um, but. I have a sketchbook because those um are pretty handy and they do have very very thick pages which is good um for me and there are a lot of them in there <laughs> yeah I know um also not product placement in any way I'm not getting sponsored I know I don't have to say this but I'm gonna say it anyway optionally you can also have some brush pens ready um. Those are basically brush and pen in one thing, but we're gonna do that later with all the different garbage things you can use. Um, so yeah. So anyways, um, I have just cleaned up some shit there. Um, yeah, there's a lot of crap in there, I know. Um, just, just because I don't really have anywhere else to put them, or well, I do, but I was lazy yesterday and didn't do the shit anyways so we have in here a blank page probably the most intimidating thing you're ever gonna see anyway i'm gonna switch the camera positions now because else you're gonna fucking die because of ligma anyway so um what do i use what kind of i just use a fucking normal pencil um fucking you see here wait two fuck wait you I, you probably can't see that or can you i don't know fucking know anyways <laughs> I'm gonna probably hold this in the wrong direction, but it's a 2H, you see that? Here, 2 fucking H. I don't know if it's in the camera, wait a second, and yeah, it's kind of, it is, Hope, hopefully. If not, I think I'm gonna cry and die a lot. Um, sir, fucking die a lot. So, anyways, um, in my recent works, I've been kind of doing for horror style, so that's what I'm gonna go with, obviously. Um, so yeah, first thing is, the fucking sketch, y'all. Why, why sketch? Because, obviously, I'm not gonna go in with a fucking fine liner and just fucking draw some shit all over the place. That's not what we can do. So, yeah. First, like, the most intimidating thing, really, I said, anyone can encounter, blank page. No shit, it's, it's literally more scary than any fucking picture you can draw. It's more intimidating. It's, it's not scary, but yeah, intimidating, you know. Anyways, mic drop. Uh, I hope the page is, yeah, it's kind of centered now. Um, so, first thing that comes to mind, uh, no. <laughs> so, I thought of um, creating some character. Definitely, yeah, so, uh, I actually wanted to go with this with only like this, but it does not, it, that, well that would work, that's gonna fuck up the ratio, so ye, yeah. I'm only gonna be drawing it like this here then, so fucking ye, yeah. first thing I'm gonna do is something like a stick man pose, something, you know, easy drawing shit any five year old can do, um, I don't know what pose to do though, yeah well, pff. Could have thought of that before making the video, but I was just, you know, I'm recording this after um, three and a half hours of homework. Um, yes, I measure the time without pauses, of course. Um, 
So fuck yeah. Anyways, <laughs> after 2,000 years of talking, I think I'm going to start actually drawing a line. So I'm going to start with like the faceplate. As said, I rarely actually looking at uh, this is wrong. I don't want to be like that. So like I'm, I rarely ever really look at like um, online tutorials. I probably should look at that more. That would probably be very wise. What wise actually, you know? But yeah. Anyway. <laughs> So I'm going to make it for a little bit of an angled look. This is going to be kind of a neck. Sometimes I don't know what I'm drawing myself. I'm going to be honest here. Um, fucking neighbors being loud again. I don't know. I hope you cannot hear this because if you can, then I think I'm going to scream. Um, yeah. <laughs> so anyways. Um I think I'm gonna go for uh I have no idea how to draw. I'm very shitty at this. God fuck my life. What am I doing? So yeah, wait. I think I have an idea. Also, I should probably mark the shit before just randomly drawing crap. Um, I often fuck it up multiple times after like 6,000 tries. I'm actually going to be able to make shit properly. Also, funny thing, I have absolutely no idea of doing anatomy. I am literally just trying to make it work. So, obviously, guys, I have absolutely no idea to do the hair. I am absolutely sucking at drawing hair. Fucking retarded as fuck. But, um, I'm just gonna make a fucking scar on top of his head. He's gonna look like a fucking stupid retarded bastard, but I don't give a shit, bro. Because, do you care that the monsters hunting you have hair on or not? Fucking no. So, anyways, um... <laughs> Here we have this absolutely stupid sketch I did. Um, 
Probably wasted like how how much time have wasted on this? Fucking twenty two minutes. Oh my fucking god. Am I a stupid motherfucker? Um, I can't fucking leave it like that, bro. Um, or can we? I don't know. Uh, I mean, suppose we can, but I mean, we could still draw some fucker somewhere, like dead motherfucker somewhere. But I think I'm probably gonna leave it like this anyway, even though I didn't want it to leave it like this. But it's gonna look shit anyway so in the end it won't really matter um as I said it's just you know showing you how the fuck do it so yeah now we're gonna grab ourselves um a fine liner obviously no shit um and this is the good thing about the 2H one I can easily erase that garbage shit um when I need to with fucking awesome razor shit, whatever. There are multiple types of razors, as I've heard, but we're just not gonna use them. Um, except maybe if I exclusively need to, I will use a different kind of razor than the standard razor. So yeah, here we go. Also, you have to be pretty careful, actually, when you know, um, using the fine liner because you will not be able to correct your mistakes. So this is pretty shitty for me because my hands are jittering all over the place. You're probably not able to see this on camera really, but you don't need to. Just me telling you that is probably enough. Yeah, so apparently, um, I just made the, the jawline, the, um, lower jawline disappear. This is what happens when you have liminal space, like very, very limited space, like me. Or when you just fucking retarded like me, um, and fucking your hands jittering all over the place, so you fucking can't control shit, and or also fucking blind somehow, for some reason that I can't explain why. <laughs> so yeah. Okay, I noticed that I should have definitely, um, not gone with a fucking improvised character out of nowhere, and I should definitely probably have picked the other format, even if it would be fucked then. Um, but yeah, those are the decisions that have been made, I suppose, um, because thing is, I don't have, I don't have that much of time, actually. I only have time <clears throat> until my mom returns, which is not gonna be a lot, trust me, um, because as you may or may not know, um, if she finds out about this fucking channel, I'm fucking doomed, and I don't know if I will ever be able to enter the internet again if she finds out that I have a YouTube account that I'm loading uploading videos on of myself. So yeah. I'm pretty fucked. Let's okay. Let's real talk. I'm fucked because I um I have also no sense of scale. I just noticed. Well, I noticed that before too, but now I really see like I have seriously no fucking sense of scale. Um, nobody's gonna notice is a fucking lie because everybody will notice everything. So I also hope that the autofocus doesn't fuck around like all the other times I'm trying to record shit with my fucking phone. 
Yes, I'm recording this on the phone, and I have a fucking, um, task cam sitting next to me. That's why the fucking audio is so audacious. I don't fucking know. Yes, and of course, I'm after editing this shit, too. That's probably because, um, well, that is why I be, like, wait, let me rephrase this. It's because everything is gonna sound like absolute garbage shit. Well, it's not uh, gonna sound that shitty, but I just, you know, I have the opportunity to do so, so I'm gonna do it fucking YOLO. Um, anyway, I'm gonna fucking delete the sketchiness of the sketch. So now it looking kinda, um, de-sketched, I suppose. Um, yeah. <laughs> Uh, also, I hope that the, is the task I'm still recording? Oh, good, yeah, it is. Um, so after 63 minutes of absolutely garbaging the entirety of my life, we're gonna go to coloring, I suppose. So, um, Motherfucker got 138 fucking colored pencils on one fucking bundle. Also, since I'm fucking poor as hell, these are really not that high in quality. They're pretty, they were like, I don't know, like the entire bundle was like, I think 30 euros or something. Yeah, it is still a lot, sure, but, um, you know, I suppose I should maybe when I have the money invest in some high quality shits because, <laughs> yeah. It's sometimes pretty hard to actually heat around with all this garbage shit because the pencils are not really, or well, the colored pencils are not really that high in quality as said, so it makes it kind of hard sometimes to do and to handle, blah 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 blah. It's kind of hard to phrase that kind of shit, but whatever. So, since this is uh, just improvised character. I literally just improvised it right in front of the camera. Fuck my life. Am I shitty at designing or improvising characters? Um, this, these are shits gonna be fucking claws. Um, this gonna be a fucking skull. I don't know. It's, well, it's not the worst, but anyways, this is gonna be a fucking shirt. Um, I could do fucking monster shaggy or fucking whatever, but no. Um, this is gonna be fucking pants, so I, I suppose I could go with some denim, blue shit, or whatever. Um, skin color, I mean, I am not really sure, actually. Wait, let me pull out my shit. Here you have the shit, I spent fucking four hours getting every single color in there. So, what are we gonna actually use for the, another thing that, you know, it's pretty hard to do. Designing shit, not only drawing, but designing. Fucking hell. Am I fucking shitty at designing crap? So, I suppose we're gonna go with a... Maybe... Maybe, maybe, maybe... Some light yellowish kind of green to make it kind of a zombie-like thing. Uh, so, yeah... Mm. Flesh color, I suppose we're gonna use something like bottle green or something like something a little bit darker. Um, or maybe some greenish gray. Anyways, I'll be just picking out the colors and then I'll just resume the shit. Anyway, so, um, yeah, shit's still recording. It better fucking be. Uh, is it, is it centered? I hope it is, because if it isn't, I think I'm gonna scream. No, it's perfectly centered. 
almost doesn't matter so me gonna start with the skin yes i'm gonna go for a kind of zombie like look i normally don't even do this kind of i don't i don't think i've ever actually drawn a zombie before in my life and this is gonna be kind of a mix between a zombie kind of thing and just a general monster or something like that you know <laughs> Wow, yet surprisingly, the shit with the color doesn't look that bad. I expected it to be a bit worse, but it's actually quite fitting. Well, actually, this doesn't look as bad as I first thought it would look like. Um, absolutely amazing, isn't it? Also, I think I'm gonna um do some changes to the like since this is also tatted all over. I think I'm actually gonna do some rip in the fucking jeans. Yeah, this is absolutely improvised. Gosh. Does look stupid, but hey, proceeds to draw another one of those fucking things, even though he just said it's fucking stupid. Doesn't matter. Look, as an artist, you don't you don't always need logic, you know. I mean, yes, admittedly, it's it's good to have logic, but you know, not everything needs to make sense necessarily, but preferably it should make sense, especially on what the fuck you're drawing. Although there's just, you know, sometimes you stylize things that don't, in physics, don't make sense at all. But it's just stylizing, so, yeah, fuck it. I'm, kind of, I'm trying to kind of make this look like the eyes were hollowed out by making, by drawing a little bit over the, um... The garbagery, I don't... Like the... The fine liner thing, you know, to make it kind of look like uh, there's still the flesh behind it, but just darker, but kind of mixes with the things. The thing is that it doesn't work with all kind of colored pencils. Actually, um, you need to look out for sh fucking schmuck like that if you don't want it fucking all over the place. So, yeah. Also, I just noticed that probably the recording uh, is kind of um, too loud sometimes. Um, I just saw that on the fucking recording device. And that, my friend, is absolute garbage. I fucking hate my life. So anyways, after having done that skin garbage, we can go on to fucking with the fucking pants. So yeah, that's the fucking pants. Um, actually, I think the color is not even that bad. Actually, I, um, I didn't know how they will, you know, play around with the with the bright freaking um, yellowish green kind of thing. But that actually did work surprisingly well. Also, I'm gonna apply the greenish gray as the the, the <laughs> um. As the color for this, uh, you know, for the flesh, um, I'm gonna mix it with the kind of dark brownish shit. And that'll work, hopefully. You know, this this actually doesn't look that bad. Um, not that bad. I mean, it's still kind of bad, but. <laughs> Not that bad anymore. And yeah, this is going to be the color of the shirt. You know, as a contrast to the already bright coloring 
there you go. I know um this is very very simplistic character design but yeah it's just supposed to you know give you an overview on how i fucking draw a basic overview and not a fucking detailed overview with other fucking 300,000 designs or design choice you know what I mean. um so yeah about the colors we have practically um done that for now now I'm going to go with the fucking shading, actually, this is how I normally do it. Um, you know, I pick something like a pencil. Um, I, I mean, you could also use some black or something that will work too, but... For this one, I'm going to use this... Use the pencils as this. This also... Um, if you have very dark colors, you should probably go with a... Um, like for the darker colors, you should go with um, something um, like more black or you know something more um like hb or b or something depends on how dark the color is but on pastel colors i um recommend using a h uh one you know yes yeah, so you know um I am by no means, as it like an expert or anything, but I think it's important to know that shadowing is a very integral part of making things not look two dimensional and actually give it some um, some space and like some spatial information, blah blah. Um, so yeah. Also, if you think the the, the um the, the just using a pencil is gonna make it kind of too I don't know too gray or something, it's gonna more look like it's metallic. Then you can also use black, you know, or whatever the hell you use when you draw. So yeah, I'm not, I'm not good at drawing, as you can see. It's not really great, but fuck it, I guess, I suppose. Also, why do I use a H pencil? Um, I use it because it's very soft and I can do very soft strokes with it that are very balanced for the most part. Yeah, so this is the skull then. Um, we did the claws too. Wait, this needs a little adjusting. Yeah, okay, good. Now it hopefully it looks good. Um, so we did the right, uh, which side is it for you? It's, it's gonna, probably gonna be the left, depends if I flip it or not. I'm probably gonna flip it upside down because that's how the fucking camera is. Um, it's like positioned there, like the fucking garbage is there and yeah. And yes, as you can see, I have something to hold my phone up there because actually, if I didn't, this is going to be a lot more low quality. And I already had one, so yeah, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't actually buy anything special for this video. I just took the shit I had. Also, it's not always about like if you're using quality brand materials um not always of course it's sometimes depending on what you're talking about can be an integral part or at least having something that isn't absolutely low quality is something very uh, I, I recommend very much because if you're uncomfortable with the shit that you're using like me um at least i kind of tend to like become sometimes a little bit frustrated while doing shit and kind of demotivated through that frustration. Um, which is probably something you don't want at all, because drawing should be fun. 
and if you have the money you should probably buy something um not no not overly expensive but something high quality like and actually the pencil uh, shading works better than i had anticipated for wowie unbelievable something in my life actually works out for once absolutely unbelievable And how do you actually think the, the drawings I make look, or this one in particular, for example, how do you think it looks? That would be a pretty good feedback, by the way, just saying, you know. So yeah, um, I think the skin is not, I mean, it's not shaded fucking master things fuck, fuckishly, I don't know, um, but it is some something to begin with. Yeah, I said, I'm not that good at it. I'm gonna try my best, you know. Can't be doing more than fucking trying my best, I suppose. So, yeah. About that, trying my best. Yeah, I actually am. Unbelievably, I'm putting in some effort. I mean, that's not really that unbelievable. I put an effort in almost everything I do, but people often don't believe this for some reason. Yeah, like, normally my drawings take something like, I don't know, seven hours, whatever the fuck. Um, I mean, you kind of get, um, faster with drawing, I suppose, when you kind of practice it. I mean, I've only been drawing, like, I don't know, for maybe two months or so. Two, two months. <laughs> so, yeah. But, I mean, it's not the worst. I mean, sure, it's not that good, but it's not the worst, I think. Remember, there's always a, like, five-year-old Chinese kid who's better than you, no matter who you are. If you're fucking Mozart, fucking Albert Einstein, it doesn't fucking matter. You're still not going to be the best. And that's a fact, bro. But then, who, if there's someone who's always better than you, actually, um... Who is that someone who is always better? I mean, the thing is, you can't really say you're the best at drawing because there's different fields of drawing shit. There's fucking painting and what whatnot, you know. So much fucking techniques and garbage shit that I cannot even fathom. Um, yeah. So, where is my... I think maybe HP will work for this, I hope. Um, yeah, it kind of works, but I think it's too weak. Um, B. How about that shit? Yeah, now we're getting somewhere. Although you should probably pick something like black now, because it's going to look too gray, maybe. I'm a fucking stupid... Motherfuckers, so yeah, I'm just gonna keep using my fucking pencils. Also, important to note that there are some pencils that blend better together than others. Um, yeah, and uh, you should probably also look at what fucking brand you're buying this at. I had have to learn this the hard way that there is a uh, yeah. Some low quality shit, even on Amazon. I mean, the thing is, it's sufficient. It's it's not like it's fucking all garbage. It's 
it's sufficient for what I'm think I'm drawing. I mean, I'm not not a professional, but if you're looking into doing professional shit, you should probably like listen to um, some professionals who do this for like daily work, and are not like me, some kind of fucker who just came across the fucking town and just started drawing fucking two months ago. Also, why is it that like my my neighbors are always like it's as if they knew that I was recording. They're always being fucking loud as shit whenever I'm recording. Why? What did I do to you? Just let me make my fucking video. Like holy shit, how hard it is it to just let someone do their shit without being interrupted or like disturb or some fucking sound shit. But yeah, I suppose it's a world of like first world problems. Yeah, I mean, I, I'm, I probably am kind of annoying. Like, also, what do you think like about voice crap? I mean, I don't really have the best voice, really. I probably have a pretty annoying voice. But like, I mean, I'm with my editing, well. I normally don't really edit the audio in my videos except for like, you know, voice editing because of a character, some shit like that. Um, but actually, how do you think my voice is? I mean, it's not going to get changed this much by the audio, it's just going to make it look the general audio a, a bit more um, crispy. So what do you fucking think about my voice? Is, is it fucking okay or are you going to say, oh my god, I think I'm going to fucking go deaf in this fucking stupid motherfucker's voice?